off Jay's album, B, is what he called it. I can't believe I found the journal that had the lyrics from 2013. It was my first entry. So crazy. So glad that I wrote everything down so I can just relive all my past memories. Because if we didn't have those, I don't even know what would be life right now. Your eyebrows give me life. I really need to get them done again. Cass is going to do them soon because it's been a minute. I was so happy when I understood it was you on the song. I know, it was so crazy that it was made so long ago and it's just now coming out. I feel like that's going to be the case with a lot of my music because I've been working really hard and recording so much and like these past few years have just been really disappointing and I haven't been able to put music out but soon more will be out and I can't wait for you guys to hear it. So I'm really happy that Jay put this song out and loved his whole album. So, super tired. No matter what I do, I'm tired. So, what's up with you guys? What are you guys doing? What are you guys doing for Thanksgiving? I'm gonna go see my cousin. Oh, my nose kinda itchy. I'm gonna go see my cousin in Vegas and do Thanksgiving there. David! You sleepy? You knocked out! You knocked out, little boy? Oh, you're so knocked So, I've been switching... Oh my god, he's kicking me. I switched up my lipstick. I'm using a new vibe. Let me know if you guys like it. Football in Colorado with cousins. That sounds fun. Nice. Was he named after the movie Sabrina? No, David was after David was named after my favorite children's book, which is No David. But he had like twenty names before. We settled on David because... Before we settled on David because, like, nothing really stuck. My shoulders look really weird in this. What else is new with you guys? I love pizza and I wish I had some pizza. I just don't know, this appeared out of nowhere today, and I'm really disappointed because it's right in the middle of my face. I just love what I do to my skin, I can never fully get it under control, and it's really annoying because up until a few years ago, I never had acne, and now I just wake up, boom, there we go. I wash my face every night, every morning, I exfoliate, I use moisturizer, I use topical creams, I use and no matter what you do guys I drink water I work out I live a healthy lifestyle I'm a good person <laughs> are you planning on doing a tour if it's a yes we'll be visiting Europe I would love to do a tour and if I do it will definitely include Europe but I don't have anything set in stone right now Yeah, I like pizza with toppings. Your dog is very cute. Oh, thank you, he's the sweetest. Yeah, it's crazy, because like before I ever really had acne, I didn't know like 
how it could really like affect your confidence and your personality and stuff like that. And then when I started breaking out really bad, like I always kind of like thought I could imagine what it was like, but then when I actually started breaking out and like I was living it, it's really, yeah, hard to deal with and, and can make you feel really insecure. But it's something that's like, well, we don't really have control over it. So, you know, like, what can we do about it? We do our best to like keep our skin clean and drink water and all that but you know shit happens we're humans you sound like a proactive commercial no because i'm pretty sure proactive like tells you you can have perfect skin which like uh maybe i need to try proactive because i need to get on that wave i am gonna go love you